Another question we've been asked is, what is a data dictionary and why are they important? So data dictionaries are a compilation of information that specify what kind of data you want your registry to capture. They define the key data variables that are to be collected as part of your registry when it's implemented and act as a reference document that all stakeholders can review and agree on prior to actually building out the registry. Now, this consensus process is important because it considers the endpoints that are relevant for various stakeholder perspectives, but that need to be balanced out with a pragmatic approach. Now, data dictionaries are crucial pieces of documentation because in order to answer research questions in a disease area, we need to understand the types of data that are important to and available from patients based on their disease and the existing treatment landscape. For example, in a registry for Castleman's disease, we would want to capture the multiple ways they classify the disease, whether it's by designation of unicentric versus multicentric or by microscopic subtypes like hyaline vascular or plasma cell type. Production of a data dictionary prior to building out your registry means that you can be sure that your registry is capturing all the relevant pieces of information that will support patient and clinical research in your disease area. Think of this as the information that best characterizes your patient journey.